you know an entrepreneur has to be a born sales person uh you know you're always selling to someone you're selling to investors you're selling to customers and you're selling to employees uh, i think what employees uh tend to do is they want to be a place in a place that has an exciting vision they want to be surrounded with people who they can learn from they enjoy being with and they want leadership uh so those are inherently uh you know the needs for uh, all employees in general but early stage employees in specific So I think it's important to chart out that vision. Uh you know a startup in many ways is an exercising exercise in bringing certainty around something which is inherently very uh, uncertain. Uh so in terms of laying down milestones, laying down what could this be, laying out stories, scenarios of customers that one could change, I think those are tools that help uh, galvanize employees and equally you know customers and investors around a particular story. So I think that exercise is important. uh the other piece which which is extremely important is to build a sense of ownership uh not just in terms of sharing equity but in terms of sharing decision making uh you know key employees who come in at an early stage in a business uh come in because they want an expansion in their own roles uh they want to be more in a decision making capability than what a large organization would put them into and so it's important to deliver on those proposition to early employees uh as much as the vision and the path to get there So from a compensation standpoint uh, you know there is a clear arbitrage between what you pay in cash where you know typically larger companies uh, might score uh, in addition to their own brand uh, and success based compensation uh, so while stock options has been kind of the most popular way of structuring success based uh, compensation uh, you know in a market like india esops are not necessarily valued as highly by prospective employees So we have seen some measures which are still linked to long-term value creation, but can come to fruition, you know, in a shorter time frame. So stock grants has been one another mechanism of doing that. Uh, shadow stocks has been another you know way of doing that. So essentially, what they are doing is they are still saying, you know, you'll get get a piece of value if the company creates value, but you can get it in alternate ways rather than to wait for eight years for the company to go public or sell itself. uh so those have been some of the other mechanisms around the basic idea of long term value sharing uh with early employees